advice videos get views. Some smaller channels that I've seen that just don't do any thumbnails and just do a screenshot of the video and just talk about advice, I guess, life advice or anything like that. Among them I've seen is Tadio, who blew up with the go to sleep early tonight video and also Profound Pondering. I haven't really watched any of his videos, but I just heard he blew up and so I checked out his channel. These small YouTubers that blew up, they're all advice videos. And that makes sense because people click on things that give them value, right? Whether it's inspiring them or helping them solve a problem or anything like that, some raising some positive emotion. And you could say, wait, there's a counter to that and that's Sam Sulek and he's not an advice channel. He's kind of like a, a daily gym vlog channel, right? But I've thought about it and Sam Sulek is, if you look at the comments under Sam Sulek's videos, he's inspiring others to go to the gym. He's inspiring people to work out. He's inspiring people to get out of the house and work on their body. So he may not be giving advice, although he does, he does give advice for training at the gym and what to eat and all that in great detail. Even life advice, although I haven't stumbled into many of those. Even though for the most part he's talking about himself and his journey in fitness, he is still providing value because people are inspired by him. And I thought, well, I don't really want to give advice in my videos and making videos that I want to make maybe being too selfish and I'm not thinking about the viewer, about how I can provide value for the viewer. So what category do my videos fall under? Is it entertainment? Because they're not really that entertaining. You can watch way more entertaining videos than mine like Mr. Beast or what have you or other better filmed and edited vlog channels. So it could be a bit of entertainment maybe a bit of value that I provide here and there, but what's the bulk of my vlogging videos? And I don't have a clear answer for that. And maybe that's why my growth is very slow. So I'm thinking, how can I provide value to people without particularly giving advice? Because giving advice is not something that I particularly thrive on or like doing that much. So we'll see. I do have a question for you. If you're one of my regular viewers, then why is it that you watch my videos? Is it because of entertainment? Is it, am I, am I providing any value? value for you in any way, shape or form? I, uh, is it entertainment? Is it because you're learning something or is it just seeing my personal journey that's interesting for you? Let me know in the comments and I'll try and figure out how I can better enhance that part so I bring even more value to you guys. In short, I'm thinking maybe I should stop focusing so much on myself and start focusing on how I can better serve you, the viewers, because maybe making shit that I want to make just for the sake that I want to do it is not good enough. Anyway, see you tomorrow. 1% better every day, baby. Today was my first full leg day at the gym today. I did step ups, hip thrust, and single leg press. Oof, my legs are shaky. And then I did Stairmaster on top of that and a bit of the air bike. So full session at the gym for legs. So that was good. Well, she's not using the sling anymore. She's putting more weight on her knee surgery leg. So she is recovering. Good to see.